Dave and this is DG Overlanding. Welcome to our campsite review of Zavakanaka. It's just outside Makado, which used to be Louis Trichard. It's in the in the mountains on a on a farm. It's lovely. So we're arriving at our overnight accommodation. Zav Zavakanaka. And we are going to go to the campsite just down this road. So some of the campsites, I think there's three of them that have a shelter like this with a stove, a sink, there's cold water, there's no hot water at the site, but there's cold water and there's a stove with an oven that you can use and there is electric uh, power. The electric power is a normal three-prong plug like you have at home. The campsites also have a bry, and there's a lot of firewood that is provided. Very nice bry. There is a grid. The grid is sitting underneath here. And there's also a stand, I guess, to put the grid on, because I don't see any hooks for it, or to put your poiki or your kettle. So this is the site that we're on. It's, it's quite a nice site. There's our trailer through there. There is shade as well. There's grass on this side of the site. It does go around the other side. I'll go and show you that. So this is the other side of the, of the site. And we have seen a little buck in the bush. So there are some animals around. Sites, there are some sections of the sites which are level. It's not too bad though. We managed to get a nice level section for our camping trailer through the trees so there is quite a bit of shade which is nice the sites are also quite um, secluded from each other there are other people down below but we can't see them or hear them so that's quite nice as well so we have the sole use of toilet number three the key is here which is very nice. Key is hanging up on a hook. There are also walking trails on the farm and you can go to Bullets Bar, which is on the farm here and collect a trail map and information. So this is also part of the site. It's just the road that goes out. It's like a loop around the site. So I came in on the left and we can go out on this right hand side here. Okay, the buck seems to have gone. The buck was in the bush. There are signposts around to point you in the right direction for the toilets and the showers. It's just down a pathway, not that far from the actual campsite. So we're going to head down this pathway and go and find the toilet and the showers. So as you can see, there's our campsite. This is the pathway that I was talking about to the toilets and showers. And uh, they're just behind me. It's a lovely scenery of the mountains. Toilets and showers. And they are just in that building over there. There is also on the right hand side here a shed with firewood if you need and there's a windy dry for your clothes if you wanted to dry or wash and dry that's something. So if you want extra firewood other than the wood that was up top at our campsite which I showed you earlier you pay 40 rand for a wheelbarrow load which is quite a lot of wood that's not too bad. Right, and there's the wheelbarrow that you would use for the wood. It's not very far from our site. There's our site up top. So there's a washing machine if you need. And these are the toilets. 
You see each one has a number on. Very nice and neat. And then these are the showers. So here's the inside. It's very nice. It's got a little basin here with a pot at the bottom. Very effective. Uh, he has our toilet for our site, toilet number three. Just a have a flush toilet. Basin, hand sanitizers, mirror. Very lacquer. Very nice campsite actually. Dishwashing. A lot of information. And this is the safe. We're going to put our money in there for the one night stay. So very good. There's a fridge here as well. It's a fridge, but it doesn't have fridge stuff in it. It's got all the cleaning materials for the toilets if you need it. There's also a swimming pool. Campsite pool. Which is just down the bottom. Take you there now. Right, so there's the campsite pool. Hiking trail starts here as well. And there's a wetland crossing. Last time we were here, we did take the hiking trail. It goes right up into the mountains on the other side. It was very nice. Right, I'm just on the walk down to the swimming campsite pool, which I shall show you when we get there. It's just a little road that you have to walk down. Right, so here's the campsite pool. Looks like it's been filled up at the moment. Wow, that's lovely. So here's one of the other sites that is empty at the moment. We could have used this one. So there's the shelter with the stove, water, plug points, fire pit, place here where you can put a dome tent if you had one. And here is the fire, uh, the bride. Could also have gone up top there. So you'll see it's quite a big site. It's an outside light. And this is the view from this site. Right, grass, grass, lots of grass. Just two of the signs for two of the different campsites. It's all very well signposted. So you can't get lost anywhere. And you also have Wi-Fi. So there's a Wi-Fi hotspot here. And that is at Bullets Bar. Which is just over here. We'll take a look inside. So there's a bry, bullet's bar.
Here's the bar. So, here we are. And they're inside. So there's a tea and coffee facilities. So it says. Give and take. Some books you can take out. Maps, information, hiking trail information, calendar, Right, and there's the tea and coffee on this side. Tea, coffee, mugs. And that must be Bullet, and there's Bullet. Nineteen seventy seven. Good, so that's Bullet's Bar. Get what you need. Outside. Close the door again. Here's just a sign for all the other campsites, or the directions to the campsites. Williams. And the others. So we're just down this road. So it's a campsite, very nice campsite. In the bush, secluded, quiet, has all the facilities you need. Power, water, swimming pool, nice toilets, showers, everything. So that's pretty good. And there's our campsite. Over there. Right. Hi, I'm Dave from DG Overlanding, and I hope you enjoyed our campsite review. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and also follow us on Facebook. That way, you won't miss out on any of our other reviews and enjoy the journey with us. Thank you very much.